Hello, gear fans, and welcome to GearWire.com. We are taking a look at the Neve 88RS from UAD. Uh, runs on the UAD1 DSP card. And uh, in this particular video, uh, it's a continuation of our, of our closer look at the dynamic section of the plugin. So we sort of, uh, let's take out the EQ altogether um, and listen to our drum sample in its current state. We're looking at the ratio, everyone knows, or probably does know, that I like to be conservative. Of course, this is going to go up when I turn on the equalizer, um, for how, like the way we had it, just because this particular button right here that puts the EQ before the dynamics. So let's turn that on. Didn't go up too much, but that's good. So let's take a listen at what this EQ can do. I'm going to pump up a bit of the kick drum. It already has been because if you watched the previous video, I did load a, uh, a drum bus sort of uh, um, preset. You hear a lot more of that kick drum. Now, also what we're getting is a bit of mud, so I'm going to turn up the filter a bit. Maybe around there. And uh, it is kind of a dark sounding kit. It's kind of a dark sounding preset right now. So I'm going to go, I don't know, over 300 hertz. Raise our cue a little bit and start taking some of that out. And uh, let's see. Let's make that snare sizzle a little bit. Let's find that frequency. Now, I normally wouldn't boost around this range, but this is just to show what the EQ can do. As you can see, on, on the preset, the uh, high band is uh, set up to um, be a shelf. I'm going to turn that off. I, I prefer to use bells in this situation. I'm going to try to find some of that hi-hat. And there it is. You can turn on a high Q, and you can sort of really zero in on that frequency. I actually kind of like that. It is a little bit overhyped, so I'll turn it down a little bit. There we go. We also have a high Q on the kick drum. We can do the same for that. Really find that ringing... So now we have a totally overhyped sound. Let's um, switch the position of our uh, equalizer versus our dynamics. So now the compressor is coming before the equalizer. This is actually... I sometimes prefer this way when, when working with drums, although most presets you find out there will put the equalizer before the drum... Be, before the uh, uh, compressor, just because... I don't know, that's just a class way to do it. So let's leave it. Turn off our high cue. Turn down some of that extra kick. So we've taken a look at the equalizer strip in uh, the Neve 88RS from UAD. Uh, it's available if you have a UAD, UAD card. You can also get it as part of the Nevana uh, it's package, which includes all the Neve plugins and a couple of DSP cards. So thanks for checking out this video. Have a good one.